Hello viewers, today I'm going to be showing off my home phone system. Uh, this video will be basically in two parts. One will be the, um, like describing the phone system, and then the other part will be um, me ringing the phones and actually taking them around the house and showing them ringing. Uh, it's all going to be in one video though, just I'm not going to upload a separate separate video for this. Um, so, don't, if you're wondering where the second video is, um, it's in this video. Uh, there is no second video. Anyway, let's continue on to the video. Let's get started with the brains of the operation. This is the Cisco DPQ3212, and this is how our phone service gets into this house. And this is the main base. This controls all the phones in the house. Well, almost all the phones. This is a model KXTGE 470. And then this handset is a KXTGE A40. This is the, this is the only phone that's upstairs right now. This is where all the phones lines come together. Well, all of the um, things terminate at. Sorry about the stability of the camera. Um, so um, I think it's this line here that the phone service comes in from the modem upstairs and the base. Um, Cause the base and the mo the base doesn't come to here. Um, so if I were to completely disconnect this, our um, Panasonic phones would still work. But um, this powers everything else, every other phone in the house that's connected via a phone jack. Next up, I have these two phones. These are the other phones on the system. So this is a Southwestern Bell. Let's try and see if I can make it visible here. FM2552B. I don't know if you can see that. Um, it's a caller ID phone. So it has caller ID on the back. Um, and then this is a relic. This is a Western Electric 500 set. Um, <laughs> manufactured in the 80s. I think that's what that means. Um, the handset is broken, and this part is also broken, so, um, the handset does not work, but it still can dial, um, and it still rings. So, now let's move on to the wireless, um, phones. This is the, this is a, a Panasonic KXTGEI 40, um, Um, this one is labeled basement. This is actually probably the one that's been used the most. Um, as you can see, the buttons have kind of worn a bit. It's, um, it's seen a lot of use. This is the hallway phone. Um... This one is actually probably the one that's been that has the least usage time on it. Um, yes, it's labeled garage. I know that. Um, don't ask me about my naming scheme for these. But this is the one with the least amount of usage time on it. Um, it requires two hands to access the usage time, so. I'm not gonna access it. Here we have my bedroom phone. This one was dropped recently, so part of it has a piece of the screen that's dead on it. But other than that, it still works fine. Um, it's KXCGA40 like the rest of them. Um, this one is probably the second least used out of all the phones. Um, being, and the kitchen one and the 
basement wine are the mo ones that are the most used. And they have the most hours on them. Because these I recently deployed. Now we're going to do the phones ringing. Private caller. 